Hello and welcome to MB Tech. Today we're going to go over setting up the Lean Time, which is basically a uh, Kanban board that you can keep track of different projects and stuff like that. I find it very useful um, for things that I want to get completed. Uh, put this stuff down. It's more of kind of like a task scheduler project. It's, it's quite a bit of different information and quite a bit of different stuff that you can set up in this. Um, so first of all, we're going to go back to our portainer um, that we have. Uh, we're going to call it Lean Time. And then our uh, Docker Compose is going to be put in here as well. Make sure you change these. These are just the uh, default passwords for the database, uh, for the user, um, all that stuff. Please change those. Those are just uh, set up there. If you need to change the port, right now it's set to 2080. Um, you know, if there, you have a conflict, you can change that one as well. But like I said, please change these passwords. Uh, this is just a standard. Uh, one that's come out of uh, th this uh, config file. Uh, so once you get that in there, all we need to do now is just hit deploy the stack. It'll take a little bit of time. Okay, looks like the stack has been uh, successful. Um, so we can see that here uh, on the setup part of this. So now we'll go to the container itself and we'll look for lean time. And we've got lean time, the database, which is a MySQL. And then we've got lean time, the uh, I guess we'll call it web interface, if you will, for that. So we need to click on that. And now we'll go through the install and click install. So the installation was successful. And then I can go to this uh, port and be able to get in there. Um, click on that. And now we're logged in. It has a good little welcome uh introduction here but you know if you don't want to you can skip through all that obviously with the little x here um you can set up your your projects your to do's your milestones um all sorts of different things that uh, you can do for project management uh you know ideas they got like an idea board that's pretty cool um a lot of different things that i was really uh, pretty impressed with uh often there you know time sheets and stuff like that as well um so you know we can go in here and just do a quick to do and actually add to do Create YouTube video and save it. So I'll get rid of this since I don't know which one this is. It's one that they created. And here we've got our uh, YouTube video and then we can do milestones and we'll add a milestone. Milestone total. Video created. Uh, new depends on I am the owner. Uh, plan start date 26. Plan end date actually is going to be 26 as well. So this would be our milestone that we'd have set up for that. Uh, and then here's our to do create video, no milestone. We're going to say video created. We're giving the, give this a high because we want to get it done today. Um, what's nice about this is once you, you have the task, you can go in here and you actually uh, start work. It's kind of neat. It's got a little timer in there. Uh, from that timer, you can actually determine how long it takes to do a certain task. Um, and now that we have this in here, it's part here and it started. We can move it. If it's a blocker, you can put it in the blocked or blocked. Uh, we're going to put it to in progress. And you can also set up approval and all this other stuff. Uh, so we've got this in our uh, YouTube video create. So we've got that in there. Uh, and then once we're done, we just put it into the done uh, state. And we'll say stop work. And put it into done. Hope you enjoyed that video. Like I said, this is just one of the things that I have used and I do enjoy using uh, lean time. Uh, it's a, you know, to me, it's been a decent product. I like it for what I do use it for. Uh, I thought you guys might be interested in that. Uh, again, my name is Matthew Bing with MB tech. Hope you like this. This is a self hosted. Um, so it's right here on, uh, my local home, uh, network and on a Docker container. Uh, hope you enjoyed this and I'll be back with another video very soon.